Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, I took a little break. I filmed two, well I actually filmed three hauls, but this one cut off toward the end. I didn't catch it, so I finished uh, filming, but I wasn't actually filming. So I'm going to have to redo that one. I do have a quick little Seguin Library Bookstore haul for you guys though. As you can see those books right there. Um, I've seen a couple. I haven't seen as many as I would like um, as far as libraries with like the used bookstores in them books that they don't carry anymore or, you know donated magazines or magazines that are old stock or however they do that um this one was it's small but it has a lot of stuff so I was looking in there for a lot longer than I needed to but I'm glad I didn't get any more than what I have here because obviously even though it's all been like little chunks of change 10 bucks here 10 bucks there it it adds up and um there, there's a reason I've been shopping a little more than I had been the past couple of weeks. That's Again, I'll get to that in my face-to-face -face video. But let me go ahead and give you my little haul here. Magazines were 50 cents. So there's the Family Handyman. Some cute projects for Robert and myself once we get into a place. I already figure we're going to have to get something small, so it would be neat to customize it and be able to create some nice storage solutions ourselves. Um, Woman's Day, this is a fairly recent issue. Oh, it's like this month's issue. Neat. Woman's Day. I just saw the Happy and Healthy in 2018. I was like, oh, let me look at that because it's brand new and I'm sure there's some cute recipes or something in there. Didn't realize it was brand spanking new. This one is July 2017, but it's underwater and that always catches my eye. I just love the photographs in these. Of course, I read the articles too if it's something that interests me, but the photographs is just, they're just amazing. And the space issue. The whole underwater world and then space are two of my favorite topics to just read about in general and then of course to see the, you know, any kind of art, whether it be photography, some kind of painting, just I think they're really beautiful places. And then this one, now this was $2 because it is a hardback. Um, I saw children's book, a dollar, and I thought that was all the children's books, but that was the chapter books and then paperbacks were 50 cents and this was two dollars but I personally love Greek mythology and so I thought this would be a neat way to um kind of re-familiarize is that a word <laughs> myself with some of these um myths but also kind of pass that along to the children maybe they'll get interested as well so really great pictures in here too I don't know if you can see it there's a glare that's really neat. So four bucks, I got a nice hardback book with lots of stories, and then four really great magazines. Not, you know, this one has a little bit of damage, but other than that, basically like new. So that was my Seguin, Texas Library used bookstore haul. Um, I'm going to let you guys go. I'm actually still sitting in the parking lot, so I'm going to see if I can upload off their internet still, and if that is the case, then I will try to refilm my thrift store haul. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you on a little bit.